Hey everybody, it's me, Thomas Montgomery IV, here with another lesson about raking this time. You know, during this fall season, the leaves are relentless. They come down like a fucking hailstorm. So you have to be prepared and you have to know how to rake correctly so that you don't hurt yourself. Now the first step to raking your yard is purchasing a rake here. Now one of these is used for raking your yard and getting away cobwebs and a bunch of other horse shit, but mainly for raking. So a rake is needed to rake your yard. Now when you're raking, you want to make sure to properly do it so that you don't hurt your back. So you want to get loose, all right, get a little loose first, oh, untighten all those muscles, and then you want to start from a, a slight angle. Don't arch your back too much and just rake. You don't want to be like a fucking hunchback and do it from down here because you'll wipe yourself out. Another way to save time is to dispose of the leaves in your neighbor's yard. Now make sure they're not home because they may get mad. But if they don't ever find out, it never happened. <laughs> Now make sure to stay hydrated throughout the whole session. That way you don't get exhausted and pass out from heat exhaustion. Now the easiest way to remove leaves off of pavement is with a shovel. Just shovel that shit right off. Right into your neighbor's yard. Don't dispose of, don't pay to dispose of anything or burn shit. Just shovel everything into the street or into your neighbor's yard. It's nature going back into nature, so they can't say anything. So, Mike is here to show you what not to do while raking. He's going to voluntarily over-exude himself so that he can barely even move. So, Mike, are you ready? I'm ready! This has been Thomas Montgomery IV with How to Rake. Now stay tuned for How to Shovel. <laughs>